some South African prisoners want in on the action of tweeting, updating Facebook statuses and surfing the internet. This inmate is using a smuggled cell phone capable of internet access to change his profile pic and have a social media footprint on the web. But in February 2012, Vincent Smith, the chairman of Parliament's Correctional Services Portfolio Committee, asked government to jam cell phone networks at all of the country's 241 correctional facilities. He believes that inmates need to be reminded they are in prison and not a luxury resort. Former prisoner Tulani Mapilima explains how cell phones are brought into prison. But inmates are using cell phones in prison. You know, there's a whole lot of cell phones in prison and you ask yourself how they came in. They come in through, obviously, the prison officials because inmates can't go out and get them, you know. Okay. And therefore, they would, they, the prison officials would bring them in and then the prisoners would pay them. And so it's just an exchange of money. However, the use of cell phones may be a disciplinary infringement, but not necessarily a criminal act, according to Nasheen Irfani. What I understand is that it is not against the law to have a phone or, and so on in prison. It's against prison regulations. And there's a difference. Uh, and it's a policy, uh, you know, not, not the law that you're not allowed to have cell phones. Um, so it's not a criminal offence. According to Section 23 of the Correctional Services Act of 1998, a prisoner cannot communicate with any person at a time or place where it is prohibited, whether it is the use of a cell phone or via a social media platform. But these types of infringements should not be the main focus, as the Act also provides prisoners certain rights which the Department of Correctional Services have yet to implement. And you know, you, you're bringing up issues about cell phones and so on and someone's right to a cell phone or being able to put up on a website. But let's get basic things right. People's right to having enough space to sleep in is not being met. People's right to health is not being met because of the overcrowded conditions, lack of ventilation means that you are very likely to catch TB. Let's focus on those rather than, 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 than um, cell phones.